first we'll start off with a hard drive. So let's let's kind of bring this around. The hard drive will actually go in here. And we want to do this before we put the motherboard in there because it's going to block our vision in the back. It may even block us from putting some screws in there. So I'm going to kind of softly put this in here. Okay. I'm going to turn this around real soft and kind of come in here and lay this up. I'm going to grab our tools here and I'm going to come over and just, just put a screw in here and just hold it in there. There we go, we got that tie nice and tight. Okay, we want to make sure when we do this we have all four screws in here nice and tight and not soft so we can we can actually get this drive running properly. Now let's actually get the uh let's go with the floppy. That's, that'll be our next one. Let's actually put this through the front. That'll be the easiest. The floppy's a little tricky because there's nothing holding it in here in the back. So let's kind of put it up here. And we're gonna kind of just lay it in there and we're gonna grab the floppy screws and we're gonna put it in here. So let's let's bring this back up here, okay? And let's uh, kind of slowly put this screw in there. Not only is this good, if you actually have an elect electrical rechargeable screwdriver, this is a lot faster and so probably a lot easier. So if you want to do that? That's a lot that better for you. And now we'll actually go in with a CD-ROM. Let's bring this around the front here and bring the CD-ROM up here. Okay. We're kind of stationing these here temporarily so we can put this up. We'll grab the CD-ROM. We'll actually put this in here with a screw in here. Okay. So you can see this is starting to look like a like a kind of a, like a PC. Not built up yet, but it's looking good. Okay. Let's turn this around. Actually, why I did this is because this area is being blocked by this chassis of the motherboard. So we want to make sure that we can bring this in and without a problem we can screw any of these these sections over here. So now we're kind of ready to put this motherboard configuration in here. So let's bring this in here really nice. We can uh, actually look around. Where, where's actually the front? Well, we look for the keyboard. That'll give you a, a real indication of what's happening here. So we're going to flip this around. We know the keyboard goes toward the back. and We're going to kind of put this in here, make sure no wires are blocking this. Actually put this in here. Real nice and neat. This will come right in. Kind of take a look at this. There we go. Let's see if there's any obstruction here. Okay. Let's make sure there's no obstructions here. Make sure this is nice and neat, nice and snug. There we go. It's nice and tight back here. We get some of the screws so we can put this in here and then kind of tighten this up. So this is coming together here, folks. Let me grab this here. Okay. 